Well, a, a Victorian who also happens to be part owner of the Harbor Cats baseball team is stepping up to the plate big time this holiday season. She is matching donations to Canuck Place Children's Hospice up to $100,000. Here's Tess Van Stratton. This is the jersey that was presented to me as one of the sponsors. Helen Edwards is a huge sports fan. My dad was a big baseball fan. He took me to my first baseball game at Royal Athletic Park when I was about three years old. Everybody that was on that team bus has signed my jersey. The lifelong Victoria resident, author, historian and philanthropist is part owner of the Victoria Harbor Cats baseball team. I got full access to all the pictures. Helen even published a book about the Harbor Cats, as well as a book on the history of professional hockey in Victoria. This documents every game. Where she saw her first hockey game at the age of five when kids' tickets were just five cents. These are all my jerseys from multiple sports. Helen would go on to score big by buying shares in the Vancouver Canucks. When the Griffith family owned the Canucks, I had a very, very small share. But as I tell him every time I see him, when he bought me out, he set me up for life. Tristan was a light wherever he went. <laughs> Helen's love for the Canucks extends to Canuck Place Children's Hospice, which she's supported since it first opened its doors three decades ago. One of my daughters had a, had a stillborn child. That devastated the family. Um, I can only imagine what it's like to lose one at six and eight weeks, like some of the parents I've talked with. It's why Helen, who almost lost her son after he had a severe allergic reaction in high school, is once again supporting Canuck Place's annual Light a Light fundraiser, matching donations up to $100,000. It makes me feel really proud that I am able to do this uh, because I see the good work that they do and how could I not support the support comes at a crucial time, with Canuck Place and other charities hard hit by the Canada Post strike this holiday season. It's incredibly important because right now, especially with the mail strike, we need those online donations to be able to come in. And annually, 60% of our budget is from the community. These are from the Victoria Maple Leafs. With a goal to give back, Helen's donated more than half a million dollars to Canuck Place over the years and supports around 20 different charities, hitting a home run as a community champion. Helen Edwards is an incredible human being. She is there for us and has been for many, many years and many charities throughout Victoria and BC. She's leaving a true legacy. This is a stick from 1925. For Helen, stepping up to the plate and giving back is just how she plays the game. And I got that from my parents, because even when they had very little money, they would give their time. I've lived in this city all my life, and it's been very good to me. And I just have to give back. Vital People, brought to you by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.